Hi and welcome. Welcome new viewers. I am getting ready for another spa day and this is 1998 Whitney, Bowling Whitney. And she looks like, yeah, she needs a very good uh, Dolly Spa Day. So let's see what we can do for her and see what other kind of style we can um, do. So let's get started. Here she is. Let's talk about the outfit. This is so cute. It's an A-line design with attached little sleeves and a little rim or a little decoration on the top. Her tights are adorable. They have the side applique. And yeah, I'm going to have to wash this. It's pretty dirty. And the shoes are just absolutely adorable. I have a Blythe here that I would like to try these on and I want to know because I don't know and I'm taking my Blythe oh, from her stand. <clears throat> I want to know if they fit her or if they fit Blythe. Okay, so they're a little bit loose but they definitely do fit her. So she's going to be borrowing these. They look like clown shoes actually which is really cute. So, on to getting her washed. I have the iron on, and it's on low setting, and I did wash her. It's getting dried, and right at the tips, it's a bit fuzzy or worn out, and I'm going to try to give her a straight do. And I was thinking, since she has a very nice thatching here, that I can give her some ponytails, but since I'm going to do her hair... I don't want to, I don't know, I am uh, thinking of giving her uh, pigtails, but like I mentioned, or I was trying to mention, I might want to just keep it straight for now. So we're going to get her ironed down. Here we are. Her hair is uh, mainly dried now. And let's take a look at the back. The back has different layers. And that's what made it very poofy. I had to press down in the roots to kind of settle it down and get the wildness out. And I went ahead and pressed down in her bangs. Now they're somewhat long. And I really i am so tempted to cut it. Uh, but what do you think? I'm going to leave it long. Give me comments what you think. Maybe I can put like a little... A little pin. I have a little one, but it's. I have a big bow on it. I had this on my, my, velvet doll, and let's see here. Maybe I can get something small like this and, kind of push it to the side. That's very cute, but it's very large. Oh, she looks adorable. I'll try to find something else or ribbons, to pull her hair hair back. And keep it there, sew it on the little this little part here, and keep it there. So now we're going to make her some Fourth of July outfits. She stands eight inches tall, these little Stacy dolls, and I don't want to move her arm. It's uh, very hard to move. So oh, maybe it's something over here in the back. Let's see. Oh, there. <laughs> so she okay now it moves. It was locked, and I didn't want to push it down. So on to making her clothes. Here's Stacy. I put a rubber band in her hair and ironed down the side of her bangs so I don't have to cut it for now. And I started a tutorial of how to do a pattern for her. Be sure to be on the lookout for that. And with this, I will say this is the end of our Dolly Spa Day. Please give me a thumbs up, a comment, and a share. Shares are helping my channel grow, and that is the goal. Thank you and have a great day. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.